Excuse me. I'm looking for Marabella. I am she. Wait outside. Class is in session. I'll wait. It won't take long. It turns out he'll not come after all. Threw him in a cell for three nights. All for a handful of ambulance. I even heard about that. Now can we talk? Yes. What do you want? I know you saw Dandelion recently. Oh yes. Longest afternoon of my life. He read you his poems. No. He perused the illustrated guide to fungi. Hmm. Maybe... No. Won't even try to guess why he wanted to do that. Mold. That was his interest. When his hand abandoned my knee to point at a figure of penicillium, I knew the fire between us had died. Permanently. See Dandelion after the fungus incident? No. I even considered granting him another chance. His heart of hearts is pure gold. He simply needs a bit more discipline in his life. But he never came back to see me. So I thought if it's done, it's done. Found a poem Dandelion wrote about you. Portrayed you as an unusually talented individual. Really? Did he mention my poetry? Horses have always fascinated me. I've always longed to extol their noble beauty. Did you see any of my work at Dandelions? Mere exercise is true, but I'd be curious to know what you thought of them. Ah, uh, no, no. Didn't see any. Gee up! A snakely whip rose skyward. Gee haw! Crack! She reined the beast in. The stallion danced betwixt her thighs. Lava bathed its chinny chin chin. Sorry, don't know much about poetry. Thanks for your help. Farewell.